Hey everybody, I'm here today to show you how to use the Nespresso Ascenza Mini coffee machine. Now this is an awesome coffee machine that you can use to make espressos, okay? I love this machine. This is actually the machine at my parents' house and I work close to my parents' house so I come by at lunchtime sometimes to use it. It's a beautiful machine. I'm gonna show you how to use it. Let's get right in to the video first and foremost you want to make sure that there's water in the tank as you can see I actually just filled it up um, usually I fill it up all the way but I wanted to get this video going now once you actually do something to the machine it's gonna turn on and start getting ready now these are gonna flash and that's gonna happen when the machine is basically warming up okay so whether you pop this open that as far as I'm concerned like I said I don't remember which things I've done to turn it on but you can push a button you can pop this open uh, and it will it will uh, it will get the machine ready to go okay because it knows that you want uh, to start brewing coffee soon now there are two buttons and it's so easy to use there's a smaller cup and a bigger cup this will make a short espresso and this will make sort of like a long espresso like a lungo type of es espresso okay now I'm not an espresso connoisseur but I love coffee and I'm Italian so I have been drinking espresso for a very long time uh, it was like part of my childhood you know you get the latte cafe with the cookies blah 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 anyways um, it's very simple to use uh, so what you want to do is pop it open okay and you want to take a pod as you can see this is what the pods look like very simple very small uh, they're just like the, the regular Nespresso pods basically for the most part for the machines. This one right here is called the Roma and uh, we're going to try it out. You want to take your pod, you want to put it in there. Now look, it only goes in one way. You can't, like, look at the shape, right? It's like, you know, when you give a, like a two-year-old like a, a square and they try and they're, they're, they have to put in the square hole. It doesn't go in this way. Follow the shape. Put it in this way like that. Drop it in there just like that. Crank that down. It's ready to go. Take your coffee cup, we're going to make a nice delicious espresso right here and choose the small or the bigger one, we're going to choose the smaller one and hopefully you can hear this, it's like humming and it's going to brew the coffee um, and as you can see right here, oh just, oh man, I, I just, oh if you like coffee, okay, if you like espresso and you see that foam on the top, beautiful you know, you know if an espresso is good, I'll tell you right now the secret if you, I mean, if you put sugar in it, I'm assuming that you do. When you put sugar in the espresso, if it sits on the top of the foam for a few moments, that's how you know that the espresso is good, it's done well, blah, blah, blah. Just a little, I mean, a little tip of the trade now that we're here. Um, so that's basically, and the taste and the flavor, but that's like a key indicator. If the sugar sits on the top, it's got a nice good layer, it's gonna, it's, it's gonna taste delicious. And that's it, you can remove your cup, okay? Uh, the drips will continue dripping into there, you clean that every once in a while. And that's it! Cheers! That is how you use the Nespresso Essenza Mini coffee machine to make espresso coffee. If you like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.